Paul Turner. I am the Data and Feasibility Controller. And my job entails analysing new jobs that come into the business, putting the initial costs ready for the salesman. So, before I started at GW, I, uh, I worked in a pressure die casting firm. And when, then when I started at GW, I started in the foundry as a temp. I worked myself up and I, I really wanted to achieve. So I started doing more and more in the foundry and I did a temp, attempt all jobs in the foundry. And then um, I wanted to give more back to the company. So I got a job as a quotation and feasibility engineer. And that's where my job was gone from there. So I did start at the bottom and work my way up. I start my day by having a cup of tea. I like to arrive at work early as well to get everything set up for the day. Uh, I've always worked to the five P's. Proper planning prevents poor performance. I work initially on my own really. But I do integrate into lots of different teams. My role involves me communicating with the sales department and the engineering department, which help me get together my costs. Getting people to agree with each other would be a start. But no, the challenges I face really are trying to get the best job for the customer with the correct costs and trying to get it to the back door on time. So success in my role would be, because we deal with a lot of challenging products here. So to get it right, but also to try and keep the costs competitive is, is the biggest challenge to me. Yeah, so shortly after I started here, yeah, we had a project that came in to do a part for a cyborg, so a right robot. Um, I thought that was really exciting, considering it's a bit different to the normal stuff we do at Granger and Wall. Innovation, especially for me in my role here at GW, is dealing with the ever-changing costs in the market for raw materials and just products in general, basically. Uh, and trying to react quickly, dealing with that, is the biggest challenge. What I like about GW is the wide range of products we do here. So it's not just automotive, we do agricultural, uh, aerospace, marine. I, I find that really, really interesting. A big thing as well is um, there's a lot of respect here. Everybody respects each other, which in a lot of different companies you don't get, I think. Just, uh, it's, it really, it's really exciting to know what new stuff's coming in because it's something new comes in every day. So products are getting bigger and I think it's really interesting to get the teams together, get ideas and to work on them sort of things because it challenges us here. And I, I think at GW, we like a challenge. Marketplaces are shifting rapidly and all the time. Uh, so, and I think that's something here at GW we're really good at, at reacting to stuff and dealing with them quite quickly. The ever-changing markets are changing so rapidly. I think that adds difficulty for me in my job. It, it's just, you have to be vigilant 
to keep an eye on the changing costs of raw materials, it will rapidly change costs quite quickly. So we still have to make it achievable, but for the right cost for the customer. That's a good question because I don't even have a driving license. So my dream car is a bit, uh, but and all, I think I'd like a big American truck, not to drive obviously because I can't, but I'd, I'd fill it with a, a man cave in the trailer. 